Action. Uh, we got it. Uh, we got our steak out here. Snake. Out here, we're ready to grill it. Uh, it's about 200 degree, 200 degrees in inside the grill. Uh, it really doesn't matter, but you really want that first sear on the meat. And it's a good thing we put oil on there, because if you leave, if you leave, leave out the oil and you put it on the grill, the meat will stick. You don't want that to happen, because then you're going to lose a lot of meat. When you pull it off, it'll tear. It's, just, it's not going to be ready, and it's going to dirty up your grill, and it's a nightmare. Trust me. So we're going to open up our oven on there, and we're just going to lay it in there. Okay. Lay it show, in there. Show them what you're doing. Get now, the side. if you notice, yeah. if you notice a little bit, the snake will curl up just a little bit. Stuff on that end right there. But, Stuff on that end so they can see. But really not enough to, uh, there you go. Not to affect the cooking process. So it'll be fine. Now, when you cook, when you cook a snake, especially if it's first time or maybe all the time, you want to leave it. Oh, that's good. You want to leave it. You want to leave your uh, lid open. See that one curled up real nice. When it they don't see it because it's covered up because you start on this side instead of the opposite side. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna zoom. Move it up. See how it kind of moves on its own. Muscles contracting. It's like being in a being in a jacuzzi, I guess. Feel your muscles clench up. There we go. Bone down. Bone down. You want to put them bone down. There we go. There we go. Some part of your uh, grill may be hotter than others, so some will cook faster. But I think of this as an opportunity to keep some of my snake warm. Slide that over there to the other ones. There you go, so they can see it. Another thing, if you have more than one snake, or if you have stuff you want to cook besides snake, don't overcrowd your grill. Because that just makes things complicated, more complicated for you in the future. Oh, right here. It's the last little bit, and it should take, I don't know, about 30 minutes to cook. Maybe longer. Um, but we'll see in the time, and I'll tell you how it tastes.